to my groom on our wedding day. Nick, can you believe it? Our day is here. I am just so excited to marry you and spend the rest of my life with you. You are my very best friend. You love me at my best, but even more at my worst. You ignore me when I'm sassy and even laugh at me sometimes. And this is exactly what I need in a best friend and lifelong partner. All joking aside, I love everything about you. Your ability to be nice to everyone, the way your smile lights up the room, your passion and the way you can turn my entire day around with just a hug. You give everything you do 110%, and that's something that I admire about you. I know you'll do the same in our marriage and throughout our life together. I will choose you every day, forever, and I love you more than words can ever say. You're almost wife. Ride on our wedding day. So much writing. Okay. Hi, sweetheart. From the moment I saw you at Arbor Glen, my heart filled with, with longing. I was longing to get to know you more. The absolutely beautiful girl that made my mouth dry. It made me forget what I wanted to say every time I tried to talk to her. I had walked into my life at the perfect time. Today I stand here and my heart still longs for you every moment of every day. Only now I long to love you, love and support you for the rest of my life. You are such a big part of who I am. I promise to always make you my priority. To love you in times of both joy and frustration and to talk with you openly and honestly. I promise to look after you in both young and old age and to look after our family and always try to do what is in our collective best interest. I am so excited to make you my wife. You are my perfect match, my soulmate, my best friend, and the absolute love of my life. Here's to the rest of our lives. Our journey has only just begun. I love you so much. I'll see you soon. Love, Nick. Gosh, you're like beautiful. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> my gosh, look at you. Do you like it? It is amazing. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> you look beautiful. You look handsome. Thank you. Nick, as you place this ring on Devin's finger, please repeat after me. You're the love of my life. You're the love of my life. And my very best friend. And my very best friend. And Devin, as you place this ring on Nick's finger, please repeat after me. You're the love of my life. You're the love of my life. And my very best friend. And my very best friend. It is my pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct honor to present to you for the first time as a married couple, Mr. and Mrs. Nicholas and Devin Zimmerman. <laughs>
unfortunately now with me living out of state, I don't get to see him all that often. But I'll tell you what, I've never seen Nick happier in his life. So of all 28 years, yes. So thank you, Devin. Thank you, Nick. I wish you both the absolute best, and I love you both. The way he spoke about her was just different than what you hear with, uh, with normal conversations. Like, it wasn't like, oh, she's cool, she's fun, like this stuff. Like, he was genuinely excited about to talk about her. Like, it was, it was just different. So, like, I knew from then that they were going to make it the distance. Last week, I asked Nick, oh, my God, are you nervous? Your wedding is in a week. And he just smiled, and he shook his head, and he said, no, I just can't wait to marry her. As Devin's father, I can't express into words how proud I am of the women you have become and the accomplishments you have achieved. Nick, if I had the opportunity to select a, a husband for my daughter, I couldn't have selected a better man. Paul and I look forward to you being part of our family. But uh, so it's no surprise he found the perfect woman to marry. And uh, he, I mean, look at her. She's, She's the most beautiful bride. Have you ever seen a more beautiful bride than her? She's beautiful. You know, I used to take care of Sally with such sweetness. Mom, I can help give her a bath. Mom, I give her her bottle, you know. And now I see that with Devin. So I know that's, no! <laughs> I, I'm, oh, good Lord. <laughs> Give a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen.